Hey there, everyone. I just want to do a quick video here on Zoom and making sure that you can get your account set up to begin with and activate your account. I'm doing this on a Chromebook, so it might look a little bit different if you're on a Mac or on Windows, but it shouldn't be too much because most of, uh, of it is in a web browser anyway. So to begin with, you should have received an email from Zoom that says Les Brown has set up an account for you. You want to make sure that you go to Zoom and activate your account in this method to make sure that you get the paid for account that the district has set up for you. So that will get you more features. You'll be able to have uh, more guests and longer meetings. So you wanna make sure you don't activate with the wrong account or get there in the wrong way. So anyway, you wanna click, click this button, activate your Zoom account, this button, and that will take you to a page that looks like this. You want to choose sign in with Google and your school district account is a Google account. So you wanna sign with that. And when you do that, you'll be presented with a choice of your accounts. My school district account here is listed first, so I'm gonna choose that one. Make sure you choose your school district account, otherwise you will not get the paid for features that you should. So once I click that, I'm taken straight into Zoom. It may ask you for some additional information uh, before taking you into Zoom. Mine was already activated, so it didn't ask for any of that this time. Once you get in here, feel free to explore, and look around, uh, try out the different things. We're gonna do a video, a live stream later this week on the different features of Zoom to make sure everybody is up to speed on how to do different things like host a meeting, schedule a meeting, how to work with your students and whatnot. So that will be coming. For now, we just wanna make sure that you can get into Zoom and that you can attend the meeting that we have set up for tomorrow. To attend the meeting once you're in here, once you've gotten activated, you wanna to go to your calendar and you should see an invite for a staff meeting tomorrow at 8.45 a.m. That's the meeting that Cherie has set up. She sent out an invite. It should be on your calendar. When you click on that meeting, the, in the information about the meeting is a link to join the Zoom meeting, and that's the link you wanna to click to get to the meeting. So if I click on that, it takes me to this page. It's a registration page. You'll fill in your name, email address, and whatnot. Click I'm not a robot, and then register. Once you do that, it'll dump you into a waiting room until the meeting starts. So if you get here a little bit early before 8.45, which is probably a good idea, just make sure you can get logged in and whatnot. It will dump you into a waiting room, and once the meeting starts, it will pull you into the meeting itself. So don't panic if you get through this and you click register and it doesn't look like you're in a meeting. Again, not until the meeting starts. So that will be all well and good to go. In the meantime, feel free to explore around in Zoom, try out different settings, maybe do a web conference with some of your colleagues just to test it out. We'll be doing a live stream later this week. If you have questions, don't be afraid to shoot me an email uh, for how to do things. We'll take those ideas and questions into the live stream that we do later this week. Also, if you want to post questions down in the comments below, we'll pick those as well and incorporate those into our live stream later this week. So for now, that should get you started and hopefully we'll see you all online tomorrow morning at the meeting.